Hello students, I'm teacher Graham from Blue Tree Education. Today we're going to look at some questions from the ACS Junior Preliminary 2022 paper. Let's go. Question 16. James used one quarter of his money to buy three pencil cases and seven keychains. The cost of each pencil case is three times the cost of each keychain. He bought some more keychains with five six of his remaining money. He spent $30.40 more on all the keychains than on all the pencil cases. How much was the cost of one keychain? Let's explore on the important clues in the question. Three times. So each pencil case will be three units and each keychain will be one unit. Let's draw a simple model to help us to understand better. So the pencil case should have a longer bar and the keychain should have a shorter bar and the pencil case should be three times of the keychain. Next, let's draw the main model here. And the question talks about one quarter that is used to buy three pencil cases and seven keychains. So we will cut the main model into four parts and label the first part as three pencil cases plus seven keychains. Now, remember each pencil case is three units and each keychain is one unit. So three pencil cases will be 9 units and 7 keychains will be 7 units. So we can write down this statement that 3 pencil case plus 7 keychains should be 9 units plus 7 units to give us a total of 16 units. And we can label this part as 16 units. Next, the question talks about using 5 6 of his remaining money. That is fraction of the remainder concept. So we have to cut the remaining parts of the model into smaller parts. And Let's cut it. So we will label this five parts over here that is used to buy more keychains. And from the model, you can observe that 2 8 represents 16 units. So to find 1 8, we will divide that by 2 to give us 1 8, which is 8 units. And to find the 5 8 of the model, that will be to multiply by 5, that will give us 5 8 which represents 40 units. So we can label that as 40 units now. And so the keychains will be 40 units plus 7 units to give us a total of 47 units. All right. And the difference between the keychains and the pencil cases will be 47 units minus 9 units to give us 38 units. So these 38 units would represent $30.40. Now, let's read the question again. They are looking for the cost of one keychain, which is actually one unit. So, let's find one unit, which is $30.40, divided by 38 to give us 80 cents. Now, we have found the cost of one keychain, which is 80 cents. I hope you have learned something today. See you.